Hello and welcome to this week's waterhole cam. No lions this week. They've been feasting on an elephant that died on one of the neighboring properties for the last week. So that's given our animals here a little bit of a break. And apparently we have two new lion cubs to add to the eight that we already have. So they've been quite busy. I did go and fix the water pipe system that had been broken by the lions and elephants. Made sure to bury it as well as I could and I just hoped that we could have a break from elephants for a couple of days just to let things settle. Which seemed reasonable since we've had hardly any elephants lately but of course within an hour or two of me finishing the herd started arriving. But luckily they didn't discover my work and it seems to be working quite well now. You can see the elephant on the far left with its back to the water hole busy in inspecting the site where the, the water pipes are but couldn't dig up the hard compacted sand that it's been buried in. Get the elephant at the back there with its back leg propped up against the water hole. Looks like a man standing at a bry with a beer in his hand and his foot up on the side of the bry.
not sure if that was a fart or if he was just blowing air and water through his trunk. Their farts are normally a lot flappier than that, but it was impressive nonetheless. It was just the one day where we had lots of elephants after this they dispersed and we had one or two and the water lilies are still fine, the water pipes are still fine, the camera's fine so we did it. Now this is most likely a male tortoise, a smaller one, chasing a female around and she discovered quite a clever way of avoiding his attentions and that's just by going into slightly deeper water where he couldn't follow. He was quite persistent though, came around for a second attempt, but it's just a little bit too deep for him. The herbivores have been coming back in dribs and drabs, not in the same numbers that they were before, but it's probably a combination of them being wary of lions and also we have had some rain which has left some pools of water lying around for them.
Mongoose is always entertaining to watch, but especially when there's another animal around. tiny tortoise on the bottom left there, about the smallest we've seen but it's uh, quite a few years old already. I think this is the same tortoise that was in the very first clip in this video because he follows the same route heading into the water then across to the left and then out and then back the way he came except this time he does a little plop into the water on his return trip family of six still going strong, taking advantage of the absence of lions. Having at these guys for a little while. 
I've seen some clips lately of leopards attacking porcupines and the lengths that they go to to try and get them makes me think that porcupines are very very tasty because the leopards end up with just quills all over their feet and their faces and covered in blood and they still keep going. And that is it for this week.